The army right now that's gathered in Costa Mesa for Larry Elder's victory party tonight. Yes, Larry Elder is holding a victory party. KTLA's Chris Wolf. He's been covering the front-running challenger, hoping to unseat Gavin Newsom, and uh, he joins us now live from the Hilton Hotel in Costa Mesa. Hey, Chris. Hey, Vicki and Grant. That's right. Larry Elder is so optimistic. He's planning this victory party already right here at this hotel. He hit the campaign trail all day yesterday, making stops across Southern California. This was his final stop last night where he actually had a rally last night. We were here. Take a look. Take a listen. How are you doing? Good. Our one on one with California gubernatorial candidate Larry Elder was interrupted when a supporter so excited to see him tripped on a curb and fell. He embraced her and made sure she was okay, and both forged ahead with a rally at a hotel in Costa Mesa. The two of them serving as examples of determination. Feeling really good. Um, the reason they're bringing in the heavy lumber, Obama, uh, Bernie Sanders, Senator Warren, they've all cut commercials for him. Kamala Harris has weighed in, Pelosi's weighed in, because they're scared to death. They know that I'm going to break that Jedi mind trick that Democrats have had over black and brown voters. The latest polls suggest Newsom is in a good position to defeat Republican challengers. However, voters who want to unseat him have 46 other choices. Elder is by far the front runner among the challengers. He believes the Newsom camp has a weak argument. What they say is that it's a Republican takeover. They haven't uttered these magic words. Gavin Newsom has done a fine job for the people of California because they can't. So I don't put a whole lot of stock in those polls. All I know is that people are mad. Uh, two million people signed the petition to have him recalled. The 69-year-old conservative radio talk show host energized supporters inside the hotel, calling Newsom an abject failure for the Golden State with poor fire, water, and power management, declining business and education, next to skyrocketing crime, homelessness, housing prices, and cost of living. 20,000 convicted felons released during coronavirus early, many of them violent offenders. Larry Elder says he believes this recall election is all about voter turnout. He says if we turn out the votes, we will win. His victory party is set for 7 p.m., although we do not expect him to speak to all of his supporters until later on in the evening. And we will be here with you throughout the evening. Live in Costa Mesa, I'm Chris Wolf. Back to you.